Okay, so the resting potential, which is a key basic concept in neuromuscular or neurophysiology. And then the resting potential is defined as the difference in charge across the cell membrane at rest. Hence the name resting potential. This is no signaling activity. And at rest, the membrane itself normally prevents free diffusion of ions, although you do have channels that are long, ions that flow back and forth at varying rates. And normally, in a regular cell, there are more positive ions outside of the cell and more negative ions inside the cell. So your resting memory potential will be negative, and for our cells, it's negative 70 because there's more negative cells, negative ions inside the cell. And there are many different ions in the soup making up the total membrane potential. And each of these ions has its own equilibrium potential. That's another key term here. And this equilibrium, equilibrium potential means it is the potential at which each particular ion is most happy based on the electrochemical gradient. And the electrochemical gradient is basically composed of the concentration gradient and the electric gradient. So, for example, sodium... Remember this, okay, this is inside the cell, this is outside the cell, this is inside the cell. There is more sodium outside the cell, so sodium would like to go in. So if you let sodium be and let it do whatever it wants, it's going to go inside the cell, and so it's going to make this inside more positive. So sodium has a positive equilibrium potential. On the other, on the other hand, potassium, there's more potassium inside the cell, so potassium would like to go out if it could. And so if potassium leaves, the inside of the cell becomes more negative. So potassium has a negative equilibrium potential. And so I mentioned the membrane does have channels that will allow ion movement. And the more impermeable the membrane is to an ion, the more the ion will be able to contribute to the resting potential. Um, and so the main two ions playing um, contributing at rest will be um, sodium and potassium. Um, the rest of the ions don't move around too much at rest. And no, this is all at rest. When you get electrical signaling, when nerves start firing, then a bunch of other channels will start opening, and you will uh, lead to conduction of electrical signals. Um, so that's it for the resting potential.